Hey man, what's up? What? Come on, what's your name? FJ. Okay, can I ask you some questions? What question actually? Adikarya, do you know what is it? Is it a food? It's a company, man. Oh, what's man. a company? It's a construction company, of course. Okay. Yes, construction company that established in 1960. 1960 uh -uh. and approved by Minister of Justice of Indonesia in 1974 to be a public construction company okay and become the first the first construction company that listed in Indonesian Stock Exchange okay in 2004 enough. okay yes so what's the vision and mission of the company the vision is to be a leading construction company in Southeast Asia. Cool Southeast side. Asia, okay. Cool That's so side. wide range, right? Yes, and the mission of this company yeah. are the first is incorporated the performance based on increasing the corporate values. And then the second one is applicating the simple models and down to earth corporate values. Okay, so what we will to talk to know about more you know more you must know more about strategic planning of this company first and the second one is the SWOT and tariff and the last one is five quarters of course okay bye bye thank you hey girl uh, hi what's your name Galu. okay can you follow me first okay sure okay i will ask sure. you several questions okay so, so first can you explain me about the strategic plan of Adikarya? Oh, strategic planning of Adikarya. Maybe we will talk more about Adikarya. GCG is like a relationship between the company and shareholder. And then the strategic planning first is code of business conduct. It's like code of ethic. Code of ethic. And this and then the second one is using whistle blowing system. The third is using MIS system, improvement system, and the last is, I think, I forget something. Wait a minute. Okay, do you read it on the Google okay, or you find yourself? Okay, no, I found my Okay. They have a report, like work and budgeting plan report. That's all I think. So, what, what you want to know? I don't know, maybe that tariff and SWAT. Do you tariff. know the person? Okay. Follow me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry up. Hey, hey. please what? explain him about tariff. Okay, follow me. Okay. What's your name? My name is Roshad. Okay. Well, you know about SWOT and tariff from which company? I do. Uh, Adikarya. Adikarya. Well, uh, you know SWOT, SWOT is their strength. The first is strength. They have a very one just one HQ and seven plan in this Indonesia and also they have three subsidiaries like Persada Beton, Persada Building and also Persada Properties. The next one is they have a focus edu educational for their employee. So they next is about the are the first construction company that have a pre cash company. And the second one is about the weaknesses because they are our construction so they still depends on their supplier that is the next about the, their supplier and then also i think they are they are also still depend on global economics condition also so it is their weakness and the next one is about their opportunities their opportunities they have an opportunities to make a road make a building road building and bridge from uh, government because they are state-owned companies and also they have an opportunity to open their uh, extend their business into a private sector also not just a government and the last is their threat it is very complex complex uh, company so they have a complex bureaucracy and it is make they are very very uh, what is make of pro and con the last one is they are uh, I forgot the last one if I'm not mistaken the last one is they about their competitors they, they are having many competitors there. and you want to know about tariff also mm, of course of course well uh, as we know that every company have a GCG 
CCG planning, they see everything, and also they focus on uh, based on National Committee of Indonesia. We know that uh, tariff is five five elements. It is transparency, accountability, uh, responsibility, independency, and also fairness. Well, the tariff is uh, about the transparency of Adikarya and they also uh, make that annual report can be read as long as everyone, for everyone. They upload it in IDX and also OJK, that is why. And next one is, what is the second one? Accountability. They have a very, very uh, structure, very good structure. It is like they have a one committee, commissioner to supervise everything. And then the, the supervisor also make a committee like that. And that is accountability. The next one is about responsibility. They are responsible to their the law and also the government act in Indonesia. What a regulation that implement in Indonesia. That is, it is about the uh, responsibility. Next one is independence. Independence is they are cannot be interrupted by the other parties other parties so they have their own decision that is like and the fairness is because they are a state owned company and also about the construction they should building trust so they should do a fair between their needs and also their wants and what they want to build that is about the tariff and also SWOT as no and also SWOT so okay. you get it I think I got it can so, you take the camera I think I want to explain something okay so I barely understand about Adikarya though, but I think I would like to analyze the five quarter. First is about the substitute, uh, substitutes good, and then the second of it about the new entry, and then the third is about the customers, and the last is suppliers. First is about the substitutes. It means that the Adikarya is basically on the building side, but right now technology is more profitable rather than the building on how the Adikarya can improve their value in terms of uh, the manufacturing and the construction, uh, constructing the building rather than use, using other technology. And the, the second is about the new entry, as we know that this is a market since it has the gap, the, the new entry will fulfill the gap to to, fa to find the best market in the market itself. For example, by this, I think the, the Adikarya should working together with the competitors to create the entry barriers to delay the development of the competitor itself, for example. And the th third is about the customers. Of course, I think the biggest customers in Adikarya itself is the government. As, uh, so I think they need to decrease their dependency toward the government because we don't know the, the, the future future demand right and then the last is about the, the supplier as we know that since this is the construction company they do not have any innovations as fast as technology so they need to make sure that basically their supplier is the best supplier that they can have but also they need to maintain their relationship to not having miscommunication and will deliver the misinformation to other competitor i think that's all from the id career right do you think we are enough actually yeah. no. clear enough guys no. yeah, sure. okay so i think that's enough from id career group Goodbye. See you and thank you. One happening.